Harley passing, they follow me to the fucking hotel. The nigga killed Aaron Carter, and now they acting like a clear the Backstreet Boy sample. You get what I'm saying? Harley passing that pusher, your trainer. Harley passing that Jay Z. So apparently, Jay Z, right? Yo, yo, people, right out here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yo, people is out here, dog. That's all I'm saying. Kanye, what? Listen, bro, y'all not finna keep saying everything that come out of Kanye West's mouth is wrong. You're not, right? So he clearly just said Jay Z people out here. You know what I'm saying? Taking tomato paste soup from people. Taking people's tomato soup. If you understand what I'm saying, then you understand. If you don't, it's not meant for you to get it, man. He taking they soup. Let's continue. Let's continue with the video, dog. You know what I'm saying? And then hang around these niggas just for the money or some Mike Rubin. Slap the shit out. Now, Kanye, I know you feeling hype and you feeling yourself because you're around, you know, you around different types of people, but dog, no, you won't. We hear you talk a good. We see you talk a good game, but we all know the truth, fam. You're not about to do nothing. You just about to continue talking, and people gonna continue pointing their fingers and laughing because they don't understand. You feel what I'm saying? Because you not listen. If you were to back up what you saying, then people would take you a lot more serious. But because you not finna smack nobody, ain't nobody taking you serious, dog. Stop it. That nigga, that, you know what I'm saying? It's like, these niggas, bro. Niggas, you know what I'm saying? I'm on my Farrakhan dog right now, bro. Because guess what? These Yeezys gonna sell. These, they sabotage the show today. They sabotage the Instagram. They cut off the this contract. They did all the then they want to go get light skin yay. You got to say it. That's Jerry. His real name is light skin yay, bro. <laughs> Dead ass, he told me that was his name. It was light skin yay. They want the light skin version. They want a George Floyd. They want a Virgil. Then, like, then don't let me speak at the funeral. I saw two, three, four, five white people not let me speak at Virgil. None of y'all niggas. And Drake, nigga. And, hold on, hold on. Be quiet while I'm talking, baby. Drake, I love you. I'm going to get the tattoo. But any of y'all niggas trapped. Drake, whoever, y'all gotta show up. And don't tell me I'm talking crazy. Y'all nigga, I motherfucking Pharrell and me. One. Hey, come on. Me, Pharrell, we broke down this door. We all in this shit together. Mm -hmm. yeah. We all in this shit together. And we all dealing with a lot of Louis Vuitton dollars. We all and what I'm telling you, a lot of people had to say about my just comment, but ain't nobody in this room and none of y'all entertaining niggas ever said nothing when I was praying to see my kids one of the last days. Uh, 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 what's my nigga that got fucking, uh, locked up for the mega salad shit? Now, this is disrespectful and grimy, dog. Because you just pointed your finger at everybody in the room or everybody, every rapper or entertainer who did not show support, right? Right? For when you was going through your situation, right? Now, Tory Lanez <clears throat> is the man's name that is going through a situation, right? Now, are you showing your support, dog? Locked up for the mega salad shit? Oh, this is this is very hypocritical, fam. You don't even know this man's name. Let alone know something positive about the man. You sat there and said, what is this man's name? What's his name, right? For being locked up for the Megan. So you know him for something negative, right? Not even for his music, not what he's done in the game, right? You know him as being the person that has been locked up for doing something to Megan Thee Stallion. That, bro, that right there says a lot about your character, fam. You want people to support you, but you clearly don't support the same very individual that you shouting out in the video. Like, come on now. Come on now. But you want to call out on Jesus and God. And it's like, bro, you got literally in this entire video, you got the devil's cape on, right? <laughs> you got the devil's cape on.
talking about Jesus and people not supporting you. Bro, come on, man. Like I said, a lot of the stuff he's saying, he not, you can't call him, quote unquote, uh, out of his mind. But a lot of the things this man is doing, it's like you really have to chew the meat and spit out the bones, fam. You really have to, bro. If you go partake in what these people are doing, fam, you're going to have to chew the meat and spit out the bones. Because what you are putting on display, let's keep the video going. Okay, look. So Tory Lanez Watch called me. Call we were saying call prayers. We were saying yeah, prayers on the phone together. Yeah. And I prayed that day. And y'all saw that shit. And y'all saw when I couldn't see my kids, when mm -hmm. I couldn't see Chicago too. All y'all know Jay Z back here, like, oh, this nigga gonna die now. I've been here for a year. Mm -hmm. They can't yeah. fucking touch me. Why? Because mm -hmm. God covered me. He covered me. Yeah. And guess what, Trump? We ain't giving you the support. Okay. Let's you get Larry out. Let's you get Jeff oh, out. Oh, you understand what I'm saying? Because y'all, y'all politicians think y'all gonna just get out for free. Oh, all of a sudden, nigga, because you got a mug shot, you with us now? No, nigga. No, what you gonna do for us? What they gonna do for us? Y'all niggas done voted Democrat all these times. These y'all niggas showing with the LV show. These niggas is colonizers, nigga. The French own 80% of the banks in Africa, nigga. That's why I just met with MBS, nigga, head of Saudi, nigga. We don't have to bow to this shit, nigga. We, okay, it's 60 million of us in America, 60 million Jews in the world. 50% of our deaths is abortion. 25% of us go to prison. Raise one hand if you don't know one nigga in prison, one nigga got locked up, and one nigga poor. Wait, raise your hand. And this is what I mean. This is what I mean. This is what I mean. When I say Kanye West, Kanye West, Kanye West, literally, bro. It's speaking facts. Like, come on now. This is what I'm saying when you when I say you can't say everything he's saying is not facts. Everything he's saying don't be wrong. You know what I'm saying? A lot of the stuff he be saying be factual. You feel me? Like, really listen to what the man is saying. You know what I'm saying? Because also the devil can tell the truth too. Peep game. Like me. I don't give a f nigga. I'm seven. I don't give a f about life or death. I, I get visitation with my kids. I ain't gonna say so. No. Them niggas walk around like look like soccer players. They don't even fucking know. They don't even know they got the dad. The they see me come play one on nobody. They still feel me, but they trying to program them. They trying to do what? Program them. Come on, man. Listen, y'all keep on thinking that everything is fun and funny and jokes and ha-has and like, bro, like it's real life stuff happening, fam, where people don't actually know how to utilize their own mind. This is a fact, you know, this is why every a lot, 99.9% .9 of people are in a cycle that they can't get out of because they've been programmed to not leave that cycle. You understand what I'm saying? You can go to a new house, a new state, a new city. Same cycle. A lot of people can't even get out of they, the city. They stuck in the same cycle. Fact. The head of Louis Vuitton, Bernard Arnault, you. Okay, Alexander Arnault, you. Francois Pinot, you. Dimna, you. Balenciaga. Cedric, by the easy pods, by the easy pods. Yeah, and the Adidas, nigga. All you niggas is fucking still wearing Adidas. Nigga, don't say me. I'm not gonna lie. For the individuals that do buy into the concept that these celebrities live, uh, the lives that they live in, let's just say that they do, right? For the individuals that know about Kanye West and what happened with his deal and they still support specific companies that do not support Kanye West. If you bought into that idea or ideology, then and you still buy from these companies that do not support Kanye West, it's like, dog, what do you what do you what does that say about yourself? If you this if you are a black person or more or 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 whatever you want to call yourself, right? What does that say about you? You know what I'm saying? What does that say? African American, you uh whatever you want, Ugandan, whatever you want to call yourself, pan-Africanism. If you supported Kanye West in any shape, 
form or style and then went and supported these companies after they did that to a quote unquote leader, right? Because a lot of people would consider Kanye West a leader. If you support, it's like, bro, wow. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, nigga, I'm by myself in the room, nigga. Everybody shut the fuck that you ain't listening to me. It's, it's it. Ain't none of y'all niggas with me. I'm by my fucking self. Cause ain't none of y'all niggas stand up for me. Ain't nobody you stop. Gone, it's shut, did you, shut up. Out. Be quiet. Nobody with me. Everybody here, half the motherfuckers on a check. Half the motherfuckers just here like, ha ha, laughing at jokes, laughing at the raps and shit. Then I made these beats in my mama basement. I drew these motherfucking shoes since I was in seventh grade, nigga. Cause when I asked niggas step up, not one nigga stepped up. Not one nigga stepped up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. None of the famous niggas, Mav Carter sold me out. You got what I'm saying? Nobody fucking said y'all saw me and see my kids. All y'all rich niggas got y'all kids in that Zionist school. Fuck Sierra Canyon. My my daughter ripped up the motherfucking couches in the house to be able to be with me right now. Y'all don't know what's going on, for real. Where y'all TikTokin' and all that shit. Y'all put up with all that shit. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I'm in pop. I'm in Vegas, like pop. My daughter had the Tupac fucking right, T-shirt. So I'm saying, witness this shit. Mm -hmm. Visit this shit. But I don't believe nobody but me, nigga. I don't give a fuck. Y'all don't gotta say we with you. You're not with me. No one's with me because no one's really with me. But it's just God. me and God. That's what I'm saying. And I'm still alive. Let's go. And, and I'm still alive. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm with you. You ain't post, you ain't, you ain't, you ain't post, when I couldn't see my kids, y'all ain't post. Y'all ain't stopped the Adidas shit. Y'all niggas let Adidas crash no, no, the richest nigga all time. Y'all know I did. Hey, Adidas was begging. Hey, wait a second, wait a second. I put up one tweet, and then Ari Emanuel put, oh, we got to drop this nigga, and all niggas just watch. The only nigga that had the Trump hat, the only nigga that went and got them billions, the only nigga that's breaking through all kinds of ideas and fashion. I've been called a faggot so many times for tight jeans. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Damn. I, I got niggas from Chicago that I take care of that still trying to sell me. Ooh. Trying to say I can't go to motherfucking GD. Nigga, y'all been way bigger folks than you, nigga. You niggas don't take care right of me. Right now, nigga. your thing is Why, who, you wait, and say, God. Say, who you who you set up? Who you think? No, hold on, hold on. Who you think the old man called? You. We put, we put Drake on. We put, put Drake on stage. Who the old man call? You. You know what I'm saying? Does God put you in position? Nigga, just because I had a car, nigga. Fuck everybody, nigga. You the biggest vessel. That's what I'm trying to say to the you, vessel. niggas, no. right vessel. fucking now, nigga. Vessel. This is what y'all been waiting for. Drake, this is what you've been waiting for. Jay Z, this is what you've been waiting for. Kim, this is what you've been waiting for. All you niggas. Look, let me tell you something. This is the way the world God works. God is Here, using him be, right now. Okay, be quiet for a second. I'll scroll for a second. <laughs> I love you, Bo. Okay. No, no, you got it. Get up. Hey, stop. Sorry. Come yeah. down, please. God, God please. runs the world. Please. Then under that, you got thousand-year-old families, Medici. Under that, you have the Vatican, the Pope. Under that, you have the financial groups that control all your shit. Once again, when Kanye West come in and literally show y'all the food chain right and then he said you got hollywood this acting fake like bro they they don't li he literally said it out his mouth this this is not what this is the bottom of the food chain the hollywood the fake the script and it like bro they're not worried about hollywood and scripting and that's long gone this is why i say focus on you if you always focused on what somebody else doing you, and Kanye West in their life, you gon you ain't going to never get it. You'll never be anywhere in life. You're going to stay stuck on, you know what I'm saying, stuck on whatever you stuck on until you move on to the next life. This is a fact. Same niggas doing a documentary. Not even bipolar and area signs of autism from the accident. Now, because you mentioned that, and you doing things like what I'm about to show you in this next picture is why they believe these things to be true about you, Kanye. They're going to hit me with a fucking medication, have a set for them. They made me the face of bipolar. Okay, nigga, big farmer, where my royalties, nigga? And for the person who made this comment right here, congratulations, man. 
uh, I'm just gonna let you know something that that what you are talking about it already exists. It has existed for years, always has been. If you don't know where it is, then I mean, I don't know what to tell you, man. 